welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World Live! Wow, it has been a hot second. It feels like a long, long time ago since we made an episode about this game. But we are back! Why? Well, there's been a couple of new things. I, I feel like I've, I say the same things in every video, don't I? Oh, it's been a hot second. Oh, there's been updates. Yes, there have. Now, normally with season passes, the final rewards, or what do you want to call this? It's a season pass. They may call something fire pass. It's a season pass. Um, now, they normally put skins at the bottom of these packs, like for a reward. And of course, on the left side is the pay to wall, you know, pay to win wall. Um, but at the bottom of this one actually isn't anything of particular, I don't know, need or want really as far as skins goes. Because I don't think there's any skins in this at all. If you're going to spend money on this game, which is completely up to you, I highly suggest that this be the way you do it. I don't suggest that you play or pay money at all for the game. I know it's very hypocritical of me to say... Um, because this game is pay to win basically and you fight against you know pvp real people so for me to do it and then for me to say don't do it is very hypocritical it's almost like well, you lose i win <laughs> <laughs> like i said i'm in a weird unique position where like i kind of need to showcase things and best way to do it is unfortunately to spend money i read a, a very um it was a story about a a a father who had his his kid put in a dinosaur in an incubator with Jurassic World the game and he had to wait like a week to get it and he apparently he'd saved up his pocket money to buy this dinosaur you know even though he would paid to get the dinosaur he'd have to wait a week to get it unless you pay even more money to unlock it and it just kind of it rubbed me the wrong way um and it, it sort of it, it it woke me up from what Jurassic World Alive and Jurassic World the game have become and that is if you don't pay money you ain't gonna get anything um maybe i'll do a video with talking about this more in detail and just airing out my thoughts just because i want it out there um especially when i play other games that have they they kind of have pay to wins but at the same time i haven't put a single penny into them and i'm enjoying it um whereas this game i honestly feel like i can't enjoy it at the stage i'm at the level i'm at because you know, I, I haven't. I hadn't been spending money on this game for so long, but I never, ever increased in my my um, standing uh, when it came to PvP. I was always just below Nublar Shores. Basically, if you're Nublar Shores, you spent money. It, that's what it feels like. Ooh, there's a Pyroraptor. We may as well dart this then, eh? This is one of the things I was I was hoping was about to change because I made the video where I had spent money on Rexy and I was thinking well if I you know if I spend money on this thing and then they all of a sudden make it rubbish then I can be like well you've it, you've just scammed people out of money because it, you, you've changed the product from what people have bought you know right like that's false advertising when you you promote it as this thing that's really good at the moment and then it gets changed it's like how how much is that legally enforceable anyway I was wondering if the meta had changed at all, because it has been a while, is why we're talking about the whole pay to win thing. So I went on the leaderboard, and to my surprise, IDGT, hello, hello, I, I, IDGT, you know, the person who spent like, I don't know, apparently everyone had told me they'd spent thousands, uh, uh, they're gone, I, I, can't, I can't see them. They are completely gone either they have i don't know the meta has changed so much or they're not playing anymore that they're not even in they were always in like the top 10 minimum something like that but now the game has just completely changed to a point or at least i assume either way that it was always the standing they were level one they were rank one they were the best now saying that there's a big difference between rank one two and three the, there's a lot. Mo majority of things after that stay within 6,000. But there's huge differences. So if we look at, you know, the, the top one, uh, this guy. Now, how many of these creatures in their roster are new? Well, the uh, the new Indolacan is new. Uh, the Trana Valkyrie is relatively new, but not so much. Geminidus, that's new. Uh, this thing as well, the Anconix is new. This also, the Parabryrix, whatever it's called, is also new. Pretty much everything here is brand new, relatively new, 
and only one thing has been in it for a while. That is the Imperator Sutius. Now, I'm, you know, maybe there is different ways of playing the game, and therefore you're able to use dinosaurs in whichever way you see fit. It just seems like some are better than others. Now, maybe that's just one person. No, it ain't. Because if we go on this one, uh, you've got basically the same kind of things all new dinosaurs, except for this one, the Arctodistus, that, that one. Uh, how about rank number three? Um, well, some familiar ones, some not so. Basically, you can go through most of these, you know, accounts, and you will find probably half the team, if not more, that are all new creatures. It's getting beyond a joke now, because every time a new thing is put in, it just pushes all of these. Like, if we have a look at these, how, how many of these do you actually see in battles? When was the last time you saw Hadrosaurlux? Gorgotrebex? I mean, Anglosaurlux pops in occasionally. Um, Model Rhino is never used. Draco, the birds never used. Scorpius Gen 3 is never used. What doesn't help this? I mean, this is like a rant video, I guess. We will actually uh, unlock some things, or at least. Oh, let's unlock. Is it Panthera? Yes, there it is. The Panthera, which is not made from the. Panthera new thing, which is basically the, their Rexy. It's like, there's only two dinosaurs that have been put in this game that are legendaries that aren't hybrids, and Rexy's one of them, and also this Panthera thing is also another one. And we may as well level up the Sunga Scorpius, because why not? I got plenty of coin, and I, it's gonna help, I hope, maybe. This game is five years old. Technically, it's four, but you know, we're in 2023, because it came out in 2018, and... It has changed a lot. It has changed for the better. Some, some might say it might change for the worse. Some others would say. Um, but generally, the quality of the game is decent. But, you know, you've got all this pay to win. And then also, I was just, you know, I'm used to now just swapping through multiple app games, you know, and not having a problem. For some other reason, Just World Live takes so long to open. I don't think that's just me. I see people reporting loads of issues as well. And not only that, but we've got this glitch in the game now where dinosaurs just, they disappear. No reason, it's just a bug. It's obviously gonna be fixed, but it's just like, how does this happen? This was the problem before. Also, I think we could probably find the new hybrid as well uh, to show that it also has this, anything that has certain effects onto it is now white. Don't know why either. Also, whenever a dinosaur has an effect happen to it, it goes completely white. It's just like, and not only that, but when I, I mean, I was, I was in my apartment, I was playing my, you know, I was just, I was connected to the Wi-Fi, uh, you know, it's like freaking super fast, bejeebus, anything I've ever had, and all of a sudden, when I was doing PvP of the tournaments, the game just decided like, oh, we're just gonna stop responding. Luckily, I was already losing, so it didn't really bother me too much, but like, Everything was fine, and then all of a sudden, the timer just ticked down, went to zero, and then just nothing happened. Like, his turn didn't happen, my turn didn't happen, and I was like, sweet, cool. No, <laughs> ah, there's just glitches in this game that, like, why? <laughs> You've had four freaking years to iron these out. Obviously, it's something that was added, and then it caused, like, an effect, and, like, a domino effect, and then some other things stopped working, and that's what happens, but... What I'm going to do... Oh, I'm actually going to unlock this. This is the new thing that's um, coming out in the tournament for the alliances. And a lot of people have used it. However, you know, this wasn't in the last update. It was in the update before that. Which means that, you know, it's probably not as good as it was when it was first released. Let's be honest, that's how these things go. You, you know, Jam City, Lydia, whatever. They're not going to release a the tournament to collect DNA for a dinosaur that is really good. No. Uh, and maybe they're going to do the same with this one. I've actually got quite a few, like, pops I could do with this. Ah, sod. I don't need Argentavis DNA for anything else. Sweet. I got, like, barely 20 per pop there as an average. And we can get it up to level 20. What? What? Lovely. Oh, I'm a mess. I know. Lydia or Fr uh, Jam City, whatever. I was going to say Frontier there. Ooh. <laughs> oh, they would hate to be associated with uh, this. Um, but they, uh, there's two now. And, and it basically is twice as much. Um, saying that, I guess, you know, if it is twice as much, you do get more than twice as much rewards. So that is a plus. And this is all on top of the extra stuff that you unlock during the season pass. So, you know, I have spent money on the game, but I think the only time now I'm going to spend money on the game is for the season pass. Which 
it's basically like a subscription because once a month, this thing happens every month. So 12 payments of 35 pound, which is ridiculous. Hey ho, we like to live with regrets here, so we'll be right back. Don't even get a skin with it. It'd be really good if I got a skin with it, but no, one time they don't die. We got fire. Cool. <laughs> I mean, I guess like when you're doing really well, you could put the fire remote, I suppose. Also, some of the skins are good. Other ones, not so good. And actually, you can even see skins that haven't been released yet. So we almost unlocked that, the prior Rixus, but I, we basically got it. Some extra DNA for the Imperator Sutures. Now, there is rumors circling the web that Jam City, more Jurassic World Alive, is actually maybe, I mean, there's rumors, it's speculated, it's hearsay, it's not real, don't hold me accountable, uh, Lydia, Jam City, um, that they're going to increase the level cap of all dinosaurs to level 40. <laughs> When I first heard this, I thought, preposterous, they're not going to do something as ridiculous as that, because that would mean that everything everybody's already got, you know, and the fact that every time a dinosaur increases in level, it needs more and more DNA. Two things, I think, lead credence to those theories. Uh, the first one is if we look at Jurassic World, the game, the top level is level 40. Hmm. It would make sense if they were both level 40 in both games. Uh, second thing, when you unlock an apex dinosaur in this game, it's like level 24 already. Or it's like level 26. It's something ridiculous. I'll have to have a look. I think unique is level 21. And yeah, it's level 26. So it's only four levels of upgrading it to max. Which, you know, is great because it's an apex. But at the same time, something about that just feels like... If they increased the level 40, it would make sense because then it takes even longer to get it. But then also it's not as much DNA and, you know, it's level 26. Why not just, you know, when you unlock it, it's level 30 already. I mean, of course, they have to add a little bit of, you know, effort to get it, of course. But tell me in the comments down below what you think. I, did, I honestly, I feel like everything I talk about Trust Me With Live is like, I can't believe they've done this. Can you believe they've done this? What are they like? Pay to win friggin' rings around the same topic when it comes to this game. But, you know, unless these things change, you know, I'm gonna keep addressing them because they're not good things. I don't, you know, whenever I, the opportunity comes up and I, I want to suggest this game to somebody else and I'm like, you know, they're looking for a game to play or something like that. For instance, me and Whitney were wanting a game to play together and she had just picked up Pokemon Go again and I was playing this and I was, at the time, I was really into Jurassic World Alive. And I was thinking, oh, if, if I get her into Jurassic World Alive, then, you know, we could go out and dart dinosaurs and all that jazz. But then the longer I thought about it, the more I was like, well, if she doesn't, if she just plays regular, there's going to be loads of things she doesn't have. The battles are infuriating at the best of times, you know, unless you're winning all the time. And, you know, I had to pay real money in order to get really cool dinosaurs. I don't want her to do that. Um, like I pay money. I don't think anyone else should really have to. I don't, I shouldn't have to pay money. Nobody should have to pay money. But in order to have cool dinosaurs, nobody should have to pay money. Um, and in the end, we ended up both playing Pokemon Go. And I do not regret that decision, uh, unfortunately, because it's loads of fun. Ugh, what are you going to do? But it's just a shame that th that's what this game is. I can't suggest it to anybody. I, there's no, there's nothing else. There's not, no add-on I can do to that. It's just like, that's it, innit? I know in Jurassic World, the game, they've added something in order for you to collect them instantly. Um, this would be great if there was here, but we're just gonna have to slowly collect them, so we'll speed right through. Ah, there we go. Okay, we should be able to unlock that unique creature. And the thing is, you know, I do like playing this game to an extent. Uh, our alliance is doing really good at the moment. We have like a level 20 sanctuary that's being shared. Um, uh, you know, we're getting uh, active members more in now. And there's a lot of things that are improving, but at the same time, I just... And, you know, there's there's love and effort that's went into this game as well. I can't deny it. Like, look at the quality of this. I mean, that thing's a blooming abomination. But, you know, time and effort went in to make it. <laughs> no, I don't. It's this. This thing. The Arctodistis... Whatever that is. We need level 20 red. Oh. Uh, I did want to have a look at skins. So these are all the skins that I have at the moment. But there are loads more. Um, and loads that haven't been released yet. 
You got the fire break. I don't think that's been released. Drift, which has a haze, which looks really cool. I don't think that has. Roth, yes, Roth has been released. Fiend, I think, has been released. Cirrus has been released. Um, the Pagan has been released as like a separate thing. Don't know if Harpy has. Uh, Jet, which is interesting. Exile has also been released. It says coming soon, but Exile was like the Halloween one. But, I mean, it cost like, I think it was real money or books. And I was just like, I think it was real money. Otherwise, I would have spent. I would have put books in because I've got books. Um, also, Druid has came out. Envy, I didn't get. Uh, Frost, I also didn't get because I think that was a pass. Spawn, I don't think has released yet. Something like Exile, as in the Indonemis hybrid, looks so boring and naff. Yet yeah, something from like Haze with that, you know, Draco, whatever you want to call it, uh, flyer, looks really cool. Frost as well for the bear looks really cool. However, Jet doesn't look very good at all, but it's nice to see that they're there. It would be interesting to see if they gave them like extra perks, a bit like they've done with Hungry Dragon. So like the Emperor skin on Mortem Rex gives an extra 10% crit chance. Uh, and it would be more like pay to win. When we really, in this game, do not need more pay to win. Let's be honest. So, with that being said, how about we do some battles and see if I can actually win anything, eh? Let's see if we can get any of these glitches on the go, shall we? Mm, yes, hopefully not the one that, like, ooh, interesting, okay. Imperator suit, let's put you in. So, if anything, like, I think it's armor. Yeah, this guy, this guy has a big issue with it. Um, you might, might even just switch out. No, okay, am I gonna go white? Don't turn me white, please. <laughs> no, I've gone white. <laughs> ah, planes! But fair enough, fair enough. I think, is it any sort of stat? It must be any. Is it? No? Damage over time? Oh, oh, I'm back to normal. Hmm, okay. So he's gonna bleed out. Oh, increase the armor. That's the one. That's why I always see Geminidas or whatever it's called. You know, it's the Geminidas hybrid, that one. So what are you going to do? I mean, you could switch out. Wouldn't be too bad. I mean, you take a hit from me. Oh, okay. Actually, that, 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 that was quite bad. I mean, was there a chance of him not being able to... Oh, no. No, that was deliberate. He decided to forego a go and just do damage to me, which really doesn't make any sense at all. <laughs> Did he forget? You could have at least hurt me. But all you've done now... Oh, I know what you're gonna do, you little tricksy one. You're gonna go for your priority. Aha, I see. That's what you want. To oh, and a crit as well. Jesus. All right, fair enough. Well, now you die. You know, that was a level 27. 27? 37. Uh, Geminidus. <laughs> Whatever it's called. Gem Gemini Titan. I think it's Gemini Titan. I don't know. Alogris. Ooh, I think this guy's pretty decent. Um, especially with those boosts, it definitely will be. Uh, delay of one. Uh, no delay on the alert peck, interestingly enough. Oh, and it's oh, I resisted though. Oh, but it gets a crit. Oh, and oh, I've gone. I vanished. There you go. There's another glitch. If there's an attack that focuses on a dinosaur and they kill it, that's what happened. So actually, what's good against this? Hmm. Trying to Valkyrie? I feel like, like, trying to Valkyrie, yeah, it can hit everything, but that is a lot of health. 4,800 is a lot of health. Um, could bleed it. Mm. It's actually faster than me, which is very interesting. How much damage can this thing do? 5,400? Good God! 50% crit chance. Oh, we got very unlucky. I think we still would have died, though. So we increase our speed. Ha <laughs> ha! That's what we want! Yes! Okay. The spear's raking yes. So I don't think anything has a priority. And it need it it probably needs to switch out now, I would assume. Are you gonna switch again? Oh, he's trying to switch again! So what could kill me here is Paratops. If Paratops comes in, it'll break my shield and kill me. Uh, although I do have cloak. Oh, it's his own Tyranno Valkyrie! Ferocious strike. Oh, armor plus shield plus dodge. <laughs> Lots of things. Okay. So, he doesn't have any priority. I've got a big hit, and I, have I, no, I haven't increased my attack. He's increased his attack for two turns, which is a long time for a swap in. The only dinosaur that had that, or <laughs> creature, um, was the Majungasaurus, but then it was like Majungasaurus, so no one really cared. Um, I guess, I could swap out, or I could follow it off. 
Is foddering it off a good idea? Ah, I'll fodder it off. Why not? Sure. Let's go. Bubush! Take him. I, what I could have done is swapped out, put the Draco in, and then chances are that I would survive and then I would cleanse. And I don't know. But either way, yeah. I mean, it's going to be a lot of damage. And he's still got his attack increase. Now, I definitely don't want to put in my comps or whatever because it will die. But his biggest attack that goes through armor is done. And I have 40% armor now. So I, I'll get to go second. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Oh no, this is not good. No, 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 no. Oh, I did heal. Oh no. <laughs> Touche. Oh no. That's bad. That's very bad for me. No. It didn't want to come in. It wasn't ready. No. Well, oh yeah, because I do something when I... Oh, the only thing I can do here is nothing because he's just going to kill me. Yeah. Yeah, with GG. Well done. Well placed. GG's. Yeah, there it is. There's nothing I could do. Um, and he's got a lot of attack. Oh, I'm alive! I live! Never mind! Never mind! Maybe there's a chance. Now, I do get my speed increase, but he's on 210. Right. Okay. It depends what he has now, actually. I thought I was going to die from that. I ain't dead. I'm alive, baby. Are you going to swap? Because if you swap, you're dead. But if you've got something else... Ah, this could be interesting. I still have... Oh, no, I don't think I have this. Oh, no, I should do. Because if it was ending this turn, it would say distant. <gasps> no! <laughs> My worst nightmare, no! Not even a crit. Friggin' 30% that was. Not even a crit. Oh, God. Is it going to be the death roll? It's the death roll. Am I speed reduced? I think I might be. I'm, oh. Oh. This not so bad. Okay, so even if... Even if he stuns me here, which he will do, um, I should survive. But I can't swap out. I can't swap out. Yeah, he's definitely one. There's nothing I can do. Unless I could, like, heal, but that's not going to happen. Well played. You know what? That was a lot closer than I thought it was going to be. He locked me in with his Imperator Sutures. We had a similar team. Two out of our dinosaurs were exactly the same. Both had Imperator Sutures and both had Trino Valkyrie. Um... But yeah, well done, well done. A close game, a very close game. We'll, we'll, I'll give him a... If you close emotional emotional yeah, I mean, I mean, that is just playing this game. <laughs> right, what do we have? Oh, God. Uh, it's similar. Okay, okay. Do we start with the Comsoraptor, like, right away? In but if they have the Geminidas thing... Safest bet is probably you, even though you're not really great against anything, per se. Aha! Perfect. Now, do we go for the heal and do some damage, or do we just swap out right away? Because he'll go for his biggest hit when he do 3,000 damage and then start healing. So we may as well do this, because I think we should be all right. He's going to get his cloak. He, he probably could have went for his cloak. If I was him, I would have just went for the hit, knowing that I was going to switch out. Um, I think maybe that's how most people play Indonemies now. Is it Indonemies? Indonemies, okay. I just have to double check. Because, I, I mean, I'm used to calling all the dinosaurs names. Though, so I thought, you know, I'll do you guys a solid. I'll make sure if I am doing it. Yeah, I thought... Oh, it actually went through. That was not what I was expecting. Okay. So what a lot of... Um, players do at this point, or what I would do, is I'd go for my cloak, yep, and then I'd swap out. Because I, at least then, I've got less chance of taking damage. It's it's RNG, but if I swapped out right away, I'd be taking a huge hit. Um, so at least this way, you're going to take this hit, uh, it didn't go through, and then you're going to be taking another hit. So reduce his attack. He can't reduce my attack, and he can't reduce my speed. So... I mean, even though there's a new meta sort of coming in and maybe there'll be comments saying, actually, the new meta's not so good or, you know, you could use all these other dinosaurs, which is probably true. Um, we could actually go for... Ooh. Ah, sort of, let's go for... Oh, he's swapping. Right, let's see. Let's see how this goes. This is going to be interesting. 
So, I think he saved, saved on because I would have done 3,800. And in total, I only did about 3,200, I think. Maybe just under. Oh, okay, okay. Invincible heal. Oh. I mean, I can swap out. I'm definitely getting out of here. Um, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm putting into the Sudden Gust Scorpius, which I don't think really helps. Because I think this one targets all and does 2,000. So, luckily, nothing happened. So, hey, 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 here we go, my own. Alococeratops. That's Ankloceratops. Although nothing about that sounds like it would fly. <laughs> Dragon's flight. Oh, it's interesting to see it from the other perspective. Right, so I resisted. So now, what about stun? I don't think the resistance of stun is too good. 50%. Okay. So now he's got two attacks he can do. Um, hmm, let's see. Good luck. Oh, no. Is he, is he hunkering down? Is he ready? He's like, all right, good luck. I'm, I've got my thing plugged in and everything. Let's go. <laughs> Oh, this is, oh my god, this is going to be one of these times we need to fast forward, isn't it? I can feel it. Right. Do we cleanse ourselves now? Or do we we try and stun him? He's faster. How much faster? 113. Interesting that he actually put that on. Oh, he put a fair amount. Like, five, seven, nine. He put four speed boosts on his Draco, which is kind of crazy when you think about it. So now he's going to be able to heal. Because he's done invincibility. He's done a stun. And now he can heal himself some more. This will be interesting. It might be a slow burner. But I may be able to kill him. Oh god, no. He re okay, he healed all of his health. So it's, it's going to be a case of me hitting him now. Not getting the stun. Kind of not what I wanted. Um, now he's going to go for invincibility. Okay, so pretty much... If no one gets stunned, which is the chance of that happening for a while, we are just going to be trading some damage, fully healing. Some damage, fully healing. That's why he's like, oh, good luck. <laughs> oh, he's rage quit. Oh. Oh. He saw that he was just slowly going to lose health while I was recovering. There's got to be a way, right, for him to have recovered his health. He just needs to rethink it a little bit, I'm pretty sure. Okay. So, we were on nil-nil, and the guy rage quit. How? How did you do that? They said it couldn't be done, but it's a 3-0 victory for Ankyloceratops. Well done. Can we, can we just get another one? Another one. Well done. Well, that was beautiful. <laughs> Thank you, Jeff. <laughs> All right. Let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready. This time, I'm going to win. And it's, it's like an okay team here. Uh, I'll, put, I'll put that one in. <laughs> I'll put the Dimetrodon T-Rex. Wait a minute. Is this the same person? This might be the same person. Geminitis. Oh, I love Geminitis against me in this. Yes. You're going to swap out and then at least do some damage. No. Okay. You're going to give me a lot of health. You might even kill me, actually. You are level 30. And depending on if this is like a crit or something. Oh, no. Maybe I've survived. I've survived. That's good. Okay. So he cleanses. He's not below half health, which is actually really good for me. Um, because now he doesn't have a priority. And if he swaps out, he's taking damage. Ooh. Oh, he is swapping out. Okay. He's going to go for the uh, the passive. Oh, you bugger you. No. Oh, I swap prevented him. Oh, that's actually really good. Get in. Die. <laughs> I should get a chunk of health from this now. Because my last one should be active. And this one's now active. So I should be getting like 3,000 health or something from this. How much is it? Our survey says... Oh, it's 3,000. I was right. But that's not so good because this does 4,000. Okay. Okay. Um, nothing is good against this, really. I'll put in Rexy, I suppose. Like, I know it's coming... There's nothing I can do. I can slow him down. So I guess there's that. Actually, I don't get locked in. Oh, he got a crit as well. Wow. Okay, so what's the cooldown for this? It's three. Okay, so Rexy, thank you. On behalf of all of us at the Game Beaver, thank you for taking that hit. Um, but now, now we've killed his rep. Because two, two turns, 
He's dead. He can't swap out. He's, he might even just go for nullifying here, expecting me to go for my priority. Um, he might. Oh, he didn't. Okay. Well done. Um, but even then... So, he can't escape now, because I don't think there's any... Uh, yeah, so he's done. He's done. That's it. All he can do now is kill one of my Compsoraptors, and that's it. I swear I'm doing big brain plays here, but I keep losing. <laughs> We're 2-0. We're 2-0 up. Come on. And uh, now, I mean, what? we may as well just go for priority just so he doesn't get to nullify anything. I think it's all going to wear off anyway. Oh, no. I keep my speed. I keep my speed, so that's okay. Um, yep. So we're still 164 speed, which I think outspeeds most things that even have uh, boosts on them. Right. Okay. What, what are they doing? What are they thinking? What are you going to do? That's right, you can't, we're going to 3-0 win, except for legit this time. Heck yeah. Okay, so, uh, I mean, what could you do here? I could, hmm, I could go for Rampage and Run. And I don't, I can't get out. Ah, that's the thing though, isn't it? Ah, so that means, wait, what? Oh, really? Really? Oh, okay. I was not, I was expecting him to go for his, like, uh, slowing move and bleed, but okay. I guess I'll cleanse? I think at least I get a dodge from that. I don't think I reduce his attack. No. Okay. No crit again. Comsoraptor has a high crit rate, 30%. So we've reduced his attack. I shouldn't die from... Yes, okay. Okay, this is good. This is good. Can't reduce my speed. And now, that was a terrible play from him. I don't know why he did that. You, could, you should have went for that one first and then stunned. And that way... Um, I would have just been taking bleed damage, like now. But no, you're dead! What are you doing? You big goofball! Ah! <laughs> yes, we won! Okay, so we lose three, we win two, and, you know, the last one was a 3-0 victory, and a legit 3-0. You know what? I'll take it, I'll take it. Anyway, guys, leave in the comments if you've made it all the way to the end. Am I right with my grievances with Just World Alive? I'm very curious to see what the rest of the fan base thinks, because I don't think I'm alone... And nobody wants to pay to play this game. You've already paid enough. And, like, I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, if there is always new things coming to the game, and there always are because it's their cash cow, I, I really feel, um, of course, we'll still be playing this game. But I, I just wish they would just change. Tweak a few little practices. Less money hungry would be really nice. But anyway, if you enjoyed the video, guys, leave a like. And as well, before you go, link in the description down below, you can get free uh, books in the game uh, by clicking on that and then on the device which you play the game on. So if you're watching this on your phone and you play it on your phone, the game that is, click it, it'll open the game and you'll get your free in-game reward. I always forget to promote that thing. It's very good and it stops you having to spend money at least a little bit. I know, right? It's like a, it's a penny, basically. It's, it drops in an ocean, but at least every little helps. But until then, anyway, I'll see you later. Bye. Book off. See you later. Bye.